goddesses and welcome back to a new video here on my channel <laughs> i don't know i'm getting like tongue twisted right now i'm like getting distracted by my flowers i am in love with these flowers because they're so different and unique they're like white and purple and really cute i'm gonna show you guys so this is them i've had them for a while now so they're kind of like dying <laughs> but i'm gonna probably put them upside down so i can save these ones i save all of my favorite flowers and like i dry them as you guys can clearly see in the background but i just i'm in love with these because i've never had any this color so anyways i'm gonna put this back and we're gonna get back to this so back to the video i'm gonna be trying this ice cream lip tinted lip balm collection and it's by beauty concepts i don't think i've ever tried anything from beauty concepts but i picked this up from tj maxx i think it was where's the price yeah 5.99 from tj maxx i talked about this on one of my haul videos that was like two months ago i just haven't got around to filming this so today is the day i am going to try these so just pray for my lips the last time i did a full-on like lip collection review was for vlogmas not this last christmas but the christmas before that and my lips were so raw and sore from all the, like the wiping off and on throughout the video i'll have that video linked down below in case you guys are interested i got this because the packaging was so adorable like ice cream summertime and i see a lot of like colors that I normally gravitate to anyway. They almost look like the Rare Beauty lip products. I'm gonna put that on the screen right here so you guys can do this side by side. See what I'm saying? Okay. Let's take this out of the packaging. I don't wanna ruin my nails. I just got them done with my best friend. Okay, so that's kind of... <laughs> packaging is always weird for me. Um, I don't know why this would have a hole there. Like. Maybe it's missing something and it's supposed to have something there. Let me read, I don't know. But like, why have like a mystery hole? Like something is supposed to be there. Uh, there's not a lot of information on the packaging. It just says kind of the instructions on how to use the products, which I will actually just read out loud. So it says that when I use this product that I need to start on the center of the bottom lip, okay? Moving outward towards the edges in a short but light sweeping motion. Stay inside your natural lip line. Press lips together lightly, then blot and clean any excess with a napkin or tissue. So I should probably go grab a napkin right now. It looks like they're kind of going for this look I've seen all over Instagram. It's kind of like, mm, I don't know how to explain it. I'm going to put a picture. <laughs> Pictures are worth a thousand words, they say. So, you know, you get the concept of what I'm trying to say. But this look is so stunning and so pretty. It looks very natural and that's probably why it has these shades here that they actually chose. I'm going to show you guys up close. I feel like all of these colors with that technique, which I've actually never tried that technique before, so I'm really excited, but I feel like it's going to look stunning. So it looks like these don't actually have like shade names. It just says Beauty Concepts, which is the brand's name on the top, and it's in gold, which I think is super luxurious and super pretty. Let's go ahead. This is what it looks like. Let's see how much product. Okay, not too bad. Look at how pretty that shade is. It's so nice. I can't get over how much this reminds me of Rare Beauty. <laughs> Anyways, let's go ahead and put this down. There's actually like no scent, which is really weird because normally there's like some type of a scent and I like smell, I smell nothing. All right, let's go ahead and so let's sort of start from the bottom to go across, right? Set our bottom lip outward towards Morrison's yeah, to the short end, lightly. So it looks like I'm just focusing on the bottom lip and lightly at the edges. And then, and then it says to blot with a towel, which I don't see a lot of product coming out. A little suspicious, just like this. Are they joking me? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it, but let's go ahead and try the next shade. Maybe just go ahead. That's wiped off. Now we're gonna go with the second shade. This one is oddly close to like my actual like lip color. So I don't know. Actually, it's a little pinker. I don't know if it's gonna show up, but let's go ahead and try. So here, oh my God. <laughs> wow, um, it just broke. Anyways, let's keep going. For the sake of this review, we're gonna, just gonna push through. I'm just gonna, maybe I had it like too far up. I don't know. Anyways, it's, oh, it's all weird, but. Uh, 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 uh. 
It's actually pretty moisturizing. I wouldn't say it's the most moisturizing product that's out there. Let me go ahead and just like try to show this on my skin. Very light, like almost not even there. While I'm thinking about that, let me do that with this one too. And just put this. Huh. See, this one's like almost just like clear. I have high hopes for this one. How pretty is this color? Okay, let's do the like the skin test really quick. Okay, let's try to do it on the back of my hand. What? What? Okay, I thought this was gonna be like redder. Nothing, what is going on? Okay, let me try this on my lips. I'm like really, really, really rubbing it in. I mean, it's hydrating, but still like, there's like no real tint. They all kind of look the same. Am I going crazy? Please tell me I'm not going crazy. Comment down below if you think that it all looks the same so far. Maybe the last two will work out. <laughs> I can just wipe it off and here we go. I would be surprised if this one was just like the dark side of all of them, but let's try it. <laughs> nothing, nothing. Oh my gosh. Like, I don't know. I see kind of like a sheer sheerness to it, which is great. But like, why have all these different colors if they all look the same <laughs> like it's so weird <laughs> I'm like should I even try the last one in the box but I mean we're almost done might as well <laughs> oh my gosh but let's go ahead just looks exactly the same that is hilarious I just I still cannot wrap my head around like why I have all these like shades and they all look exactly the same so weird I still really love the packaging though it's like super smooth and super pretty so I would probably use these just because I have them already as lip balms but I would not suggest to purchase these on your own if you think that you're gonna get some type of a tinted look with these because you're not <laughs> you're, you're just not so I'm gonna try that look though like that lip look with one of my actual like lipstick products that I have behind me here. I don't know if I want to try it with this Essence, which is like more of a nudie color liquid lipstick, or if I want to try this Superstay crayon that is actually really cool from Maybelline. Maybelline, yeah, from Maybelline. Um, this one's really cool because it's like astrology. Do you see like the stars? And this one is in the shade Aquarius, and it says own your empire, which is really cool. In honor of my mother, since she is an Aquarius, I think I will do this one. Let's see. I'm actually gonna use the directions from the box and just do my lower lip, emphasize it on the bottom. Okay. And then slightly lighter to the corners, rub together. That is so pretty and light. This is normally really dark. I'll show you guys the back of my hand. You guys can see how bold this red actually really, really is compared to the technique that I just did. I think this is a great hack for people who want to wear more vibrant colors like red, but don't want it like a big, bold red lip. Something a lot more subtle like this. Let me do that napkin thing really quick. Wow. I love it. I love it. Oh my gosh. Now I was assuming, just for reference, these two colors like on the packaging look so similar and I was assuming that this was gonna have, not as bold as this, but at least come out to look similar to this, you know? Anyways, that brings us to the end of today's video. Even though the product itself was a little bit of a fail, <laughs> I hope you guys still enjoyed watching. I love you guys so much. Until next time.